Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Friends, today I have just started my 100 days CSS challenge in which we will cover every topic of CSS and HTML. So this is the first day of 100 days CSS challenge in which we will cover this custom tooltip. We will design this custom tooltip by using simple HTML and CSS. So okay guys, let's get started. First of all, starting with the HTML file. This is our HTML file and this is our CSS file. First of all, the universal tags, padding 0, margin 0 and box sizing is border box. So now let me just link this CSS file in our HTML file. So to designing, uh, so to design this custom tooltip, first of all, I am starting with the anchor tag. The data text is Facebook. And inside this anchor tag, I am taking the span tag and inside this span tag, we will put the icon, the Facebook icon. For the icons, you can visit the Font Awesome website from where you can uh, get any type of free icons for your website, for your project. So just paste this inside this uh, span tag. And you must have to add this link for this uh, icon, the Font Awesome link inside the head. And now we are going to design this custom tooltip in our CSS. The body color. So this is our body color. First of all, the anchor tag with the width of 60 pixel. The height is also 60 pixel. And the display is flex. Justify content is center. And the align items is also center. The text decoration will be none and the border radius is 50%. The color is white and the margin is 0.3 em. And the background color is white. The position will be relative. And the transition is all 0 0.6, 0 0.4 second. So now if you see the output, so here is our output, you can see the output. And now we are going to add some hover effect on this anchor tag. And after that we have to add some before and after properties to this uh, anchor tag. The content will be our data text that we put inside the anchor tag and the position is absolute the top will be zero and the left is 70 pixel. Width is 150 pixel and the height is 100%. Display will be flex and border radius is 50 pixel. The justifies content is center and the font weight is 700. And the align items is also center. Now the display will be none. And the background color is white. And the color of the text will be RGB. So now you can see this is our simple output. And now we are going to add the hover before properties to this anchor tag. So you can see whenever we hover on this uh, icon. To center all this content, to center this uh, circle having an icon. Uh, to center inside the body we are using this uh, the properties the position is absolute and the top and left is 50% and the transform is translate minus 50% and minus 50% by using these properties you can get all the content in the center so the text inside this uh, box is not visible the Facebook text is not visible because we have some mistake inside this properties Now we have to add uh, some more animation inside the Facebook icon. Whenever we hover on this Facebook icon, it's create this uh, circular animation inside this Facebook icon circle. The content is data text and the uh, position is absolute. The top and left is zero. The border radius is 50 per pixel and the width is 60 pixel and the height is also 60 pixel. And the transform is scale 
zero point six and the transition is all zero point four second so now you can see this hour effect on this uh, custom tool tip and now we are going to add some hour after effect transform scale 0 0.8 and the spam have in z index of 220 pixel so now you can see here is ahara animation inside this facebook circle and we have some mistake we have some spelling mistake we have this uh, attribute on data text we have a spelling mistake of data text inside this content and now if you see the output you can see this is our output it is looking very beautiful we designed this custom tooltip very easily so watch this complete video and for more uh, challenges click the links below thank you